Hello friends, welcome to the Flyers Wire channel. Now, I would like to share an interesting fact on Air India, the national flag carrier. Guys, many of us may not have noticed the bogeyville configuration on the Air India A320s, but a very few Air India A320s are having bogeyville configuration landing gear. First of all, what is a bogeyville landing gear? Let me explain this. If a landing gear is having more than two wheels attached to a landing gear strut, then the attaching mechanism is known as bogey. The number of wheels included in the bogey is a function of the cross design weight of the aircraft and the surface type on which the loaded aircraft is required to land. Using this bogey wheel configuration, load of the aircraft gets distributed while landing and also it reduces the impact of landing on the aircraft body. Generally, this type of configuration is found on wide body aircraft such as Airbus A380, B747 and B777. A320 is a narrow body aircraft. Okay then, but why a bogey wheel configuration on Air India A320 aircraft? Let me explain this. Air India is one of the first Asian operators of the A320. When Air India decided to order for A320, engineering team of Air India decided to opt for bogey wheel configuration as runways in India were not yet fully developed at that time. So they requested Airbus for a bogey wheel. Airbus fulfilled Air India's order. No customer in the world opted for that. Later after some years of service, Air India needed new landing gears and requested Airbus for that. But since there are no other A320 bogeyville configuration airlines other than Air India, Airbus displaced those jigs and frames which are required to manufacture landing gear. Then Airbus demanded huge amount for new landing gears. Air India officials decided that rather than buying new landing gear, it is better to ground the aircraft. Then many of the A320s were grounded. This is the reason we rarely found the A320 with a bogey wheel configuration. But later, however, after the runways were improvised and the normal configuration landing gear was sufficient to land the aircraft. Thank you friends for watching this video. Please like, share and subscribe.